Hi guys, welcome back to Wine Testing Me, and um, we're back over at uh, uh, Dan Vineyards, and we want to talk a little bit about the family. The last time I was here, I was here about two years ago, and um, well, the, one of the daughters here was telling me the story about how they grew up around the vineyards and how the dad used to wake them up at five in the morning to go take care of you know whatever was uh, needed at the vineyards at the time, and uh, how much uh, how much she respected all the workers and and the actual process and how much more she appreciated the wine. And uh, right here we have a little bit of uh, rosé, it's called the uh, Blushing Sisters. And this is gonna be it. I'm gonna try it. It's very crisp, uh, it's very floral. Um, it's got a hint of sweet, sweet like honey. And it's just to die for. I mean, this is just one of those uh, Russian rivers Valley Pinot Noirs that uh, rosés that are just you don't get many of them. Mm. Actually, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna keep this. I think I might drink it. No, please go ahead. No problem, please. No problem. She's stealing. I'm just kidding. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna go ahead and go with um, uh, one of the Pinot Noirs that was named after Isabella, one of the daughters. And. I tried earlier. This is a typical Russian River Valley with a twist. Russian River Valley Pinot Noir. Um, a little bit like caramelized sugar at the end. Some bright berries in the front. It almost tastes like raspberry, a little strawberry in the front of it. And uh, we're gonna move on to the uh, Thomas Road Vineyard Pinot Noir. If I'm, if I'm correct, this comes from her side of the family, right? The Thomas Vineyard? That is, that is part of actually the Dutton profile. So the the one, Dutton profile. The one that I took away, um, the La Familia, is the one that comes from Tracy's family. Okay. And that's the, the color that they vineyard. Okay, mm -hmm. thank, you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you. This is going to be a little bit bolder uh, for Pinot. Um, definitely some cherry in the back of it. And um, a nice uh, finish of like some kind of a, maybe a little twist of vanilla. No, it's just actually a twist of, a little bit of twist of old world. And that's the... Uh, Thomas Road Vineyard Pinot Noir 2017. The first one I tried was the uh, the one that was named after one of the daughters is the uh, Isabella and it's a 2015 Russian River Valley. Uh, and then we're gonna try La Familia Pinot Noir. We don't have the bottle here, but and this actually comes from Tracy, the owners, one of the owners, uh, her side of the family. They grow on the uh, nor northern side of this region. A little more burgundy style, a twist of old world as well. Not as much fruit, a little bit more dry, and uh, but it's very elegant, very beautiful. I want you to see the bar. This is how beautiful this place is, and it's all small, a small family that owns this, and uh, the way they made it happen is just incredible. Um, I mean. Really nice ones that represent some of county really well. And I'm proud of that. Yeah, this is very good. God. Very smooth at the end. It starts strong, but then it's very smooth at the end. My favorite is actually Isabella's. I'm more of a Russian River Valley Pinot Noir style drinker. It's just, it's like the best juice you're ever gonna hold on. Fancy juice. <laughs> well, you guys, I wanna go out on the property in a minute and uh, we're gonna do a little walk in, a little tour. In the meantime, we're gonna stop the tasting. No more drinking for me, I gotta drive. And um, we'll be back with you guys, okay? Welcome back to Fantastic Me.